Hey what's up guys welcome back to my channel technology and I'm back with another exciting video and in this video I'm going to show you how to create your own FTP server on your Android mobile phone if you don't know about what is FTP server then I must tell you the FTP server is a file transfer protocol server that's mean you can transfer your file from one location to another location that's mean if you will create your FTP server on your Android mobile phone then you can uh, transfer your file from uh, your mobile to your computer and your computer to your mobile so i will show you that how to create your ftp server on your android mobile phone so you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe my channel because it's really encourage me and motivate me to make more videos like this and as well as you will get a notification whenever i will upload a new tech related videos on my channel so please do subscribe guys it's free <laughs> So at first you need to open your play store and after that search on their Wi-Fi FTP server okay this one so as you can see here is a logo Wi-Fi FTP server so you need to install this application on your Android mobile phone first so click on install so installation is successfully done so, so it's installing so uh, now you need to click on open so now I have to click on the start button. So now as you can see here is a on the below is showing uh, server URL is FTP uh, dot uh, uh, is to slash slash 192.168.0.101. So I need to copy paste this URL on my browser. So as you can see on my left side, I will paste this uh, URL to my browser FTP uh, slash slash 192.168.0.1. Uh, 0 0.101 is to triple to one triple to one is port port number so now I have to click on enter so now as you can see all are the all are the uh, my files are showing on there on my mobile files are showing on there so uh, if if uh, if you open this FTP server through your browser you can only download this file but you cannot uh, you cannot delete or modify this file so to modify this file so you need to go to your my computer and after that you need to right click on there and click on add a network location and after that click on next and then choose a custom network and after that you need to copy paste this URL on there like this copy paste this URL and after that click on next and login with anonymously so click on next and then next and then finish so as you can see here is my all all are my uh, mobile files are showing on there so so uh, you can download and delete this file from here so I will delete one file from here as you can see successfully deleted so you can also use this uh, server through your filezilla client i will show you how to do that just open your filezilla client from here click on run and after that you need to you need to uh, you need to type on there 192.168.0.101 and uh, no need to put any username and password and after that you need to port number is 2221 and click on quick connect and after that as you can see all are my uh, files are showing on there you can download any file from your from there on your computer so I will uh, show you the transfer speed how much I am getting because it's connected uh, through LAN so I, I will transfer this one near about 1 GB file on there so click on overwrite as you can see here is my file uh, getting 12 Mbps near about 12 Mbps transfer speed so that means it's working uh, on your LAN so that's the reason you are getting uh, I'm getting like uh, speed like this so so through this way you can make your FTP server on your Android mobile phone and transfer any file from your mobile to computer and computer to mobile so I hope this video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on that subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any queries or questions then comments below see you on next video next time take care